In this video, I'll be showing you how to sign in with a QR code on your Amazon Fire Stick. Now, this is actually a very quick and simple process, so make sure you watch this video all the way to the end so you don't miss any important steps. Now, in order to sign in with a QR code on your Amazon Fire Stick, you must first turn on your Amazon Fire Stick and just go to log in. If you aren't yet logged into your account, you will actually see this page when you open it up and it will give you two options. You can either sign in to an existing account or if you're new to Amazon, you can create a free account. Now, since we're trying to sign in with a QR code, I'm assuming most of you have already got an account and are trying to sign in using a QR code to that account. So if that is the case, you can go ahead and choose this option on the left, which is have an account, sign in. So from there, they will actually give us two different options. We can either sign in with a code or we can sign in with a QR code. Now, since we're trying to sign in with a QR code, we're going to go with the second option. And they will actually give us a QR code as well as two simple steps. The first step is to scan the QR code with your mobile device. And the second step is to sign in to your Amazon account. So from there, you want to go ahead and open up your phone and you can just go into your camera app. You can then simply hover your camera over the QR code. And as long as you are on photo mode, you will actually see a yellow box appear around the QR code as well as this yellow link, which in this photo says Apple, but since you're signing into Amazon Fire Stick, it's going to say Amazon. And you want to go ahead and click this button right here. From there, you can simply confirm that it is you trying to sign in via that QR code. And once you click accept, you'll then be logged in on your Amazon Fire Stick on the same account that you use on your phone. So that's how you can sign in with a QR code on your Amazon Fire Stick. I hope you found this video helpful and thanks for watching.